Okay, symmetric test. Symmetric test, uh, we refer to the following theorem, which makes easy to sketch the graph of the polar curves. A. A curve in polar coordinates is symmetric about x-axis if replacing theta by negative theta in its equation produces an equivalent equation. B. A curve in polar coordinates is symmetric about the y-axis if replacing theta by pi minus theta and its equation in its equation produces an equivalent equation. C. A curve in polar coordinates is symmetric about the origin if replacing theta by pi plus theta or replacing r by negative r in this equation produce an equivalent equation. These are the symmetric tests. For example, if we are given r equals to f theta, you can see in these pictures these three cases. Uh, in the case of uh, symmetric symmetricity by x polar axis, you can see these two points are located in the symmetric position. Uh, if the graph is symmetric in such way, for n of all points are located like this, then it will be symmetric by x, uh, polar axis. In the b case, the points are located in the way that r theta and pi minus theta at the values at that points are same. Uh, in the case of uh, symmetricity about uh, polar x polar pole, then you can see the point by rotation to the pi plus theta gives the similar uh, r. Let uh, consider this example. Test the polar curve r. 3 sine 5 theta is symmetric about y axis. So we need to check the formula f pi minus theta equals to f theta. We take the 3 sine 5 theta and consider f pi minus theta and we apply the formula sine alpha minus beta equals to sine alpha cosine beta minus cosine alpha sine beta. Then we open the brackets using this formula and take into account that sine 5 pi is 0, cosine 5 pi negative 1. We got 3 sine 5 theta, which is exactly f theta, and which proves that our function is symmetric about y axis. Sketch the graph of the, this function in polar coordinates. Okay, here we need to use the symmetricity test to make it easy. If it is symmetric about, for example, some axes, we plot the graph in one part. In other part, we just reflect symmetrically to the initial position. So you can see here, if we replace theta by negative theta, does not uh, change the equation. So it is symmetric about polar axis. Okay. Okay, so let's uh, make uh, some points. For example, theta equals to 0, r is 2. Theta equals to pi over 3, r is 1. Theta equals to pi over 2, r equals to 2. Theta equals to, for example, 2 pi by 3 r is 3, theta equals to pi, r is 4. You can check these values. We can uh, sketch the graph by connecting this point smoothly with the continuous line. After that, we symmetrically reflect these points to the down because it is uh, symmetric by x, x polar axis, right? So these points we reflect to the down and we obtain the equation or uh, graph of the this function. Okay, you can see here this is a graph. Okay. <clears throat> 